This short, simple guide to the element zinc will provide facts and information for chemistry students who are learning about the periodic table, and in particular, the element zinc. Each chemical element is given a unique chemical symbol, which is used all over the world. The chemical symbol for zinc is Zn. The chemical symbols of elements come from their English, Greek, or Latin names. The first letter of a symbol is always a capital letter, and if there are any subsequent letters, they are expressed in lower case. The name originates from a derivation of the German words zinc, zinken, and zinkum, meaning tooth-like, pointed, or jagged, and it is believed that these words were used in reference to the metallic zinc crystals, which have a needle-like appearance after smelting. The crystalline structure can easily be seen on galvanized iron sheets. All of the chemical elements are given a unique atomic number. The atomic number for zinc is 30. Atoms are made up of three kinds of smaller particles, called protons, neutrons, and electrons. The atomic number is the number of protons in the atom. The chemical elements of the periodic table are shown in order of atomic number, and identified by their symbol. The periodic table is a chart showing the symbols and the atomic numbers of all known elements, such as zinc, in one large grid. The chemical elements of the periodic table are placed in order of their atomic numbers. Atomic numbers increase as you move across a row, called a group, or down a column, called a period. The atomic number of zinc is 30. The element symbol for zinc is Zn. In 1526, Paracelsus, a Swiss-born German chemist, was the first to publish a reference to the metal as zincum. In 1546, zinc was recognized in Europe as a separate metal when the German scientist Georg Agricola observed that a metal that he called zincum was produced in mines in Silesia, a region which is now part of Germany and Poland. In 1746, zinc was isolated from its minerals by the chemist Andreas Margraff by heating calamine and carbon. Antoine Lavoisier listed zinc as an element in 1787. The element zinc is one of over 100 different chemical elements that are known to modern chemistry. Each element is first identified at room temperature and pressure as being a solid, liquid, or gas, referred to as states of matter. Zinc is a solid at normal room temperature and pressure. Each element has physical properties that can be observed and measured, such as color, density, and odor. The chemical properties are the characteristics that determine how a substance will react with other substances, such as water or oxygen. What is zinc? In a general overview of the element, we can at first describe zinc as a solid. It is a bluish-white, lustrous, metallic element which is relatively soft. Zinc is not abundant in nature, although zinc ores are widely and abundantly distributed throughout the world. A total of 66 zinc ores are known, the most important of which are sphalerite, willemite, calamine, smithsonite, and franklinite. The more specific physical properties of zinc can usually be observed using our senses, or involve a numerical measurement, such as determining its boiling, freezing, and melting points. The physical properties of zinc are it is a solid, bluish-white, relatively soft, shiny metal. It is neither ductile nor malleable at room temperature. However, when heated, it becomes ductile and malleable and can then be rolled into sheets. The chemical properties are the characteristics that determine how zinc will react with other substances when it is changed chemically. Zinc is a fairly reactive metal that will combine with oxygen and other non-metals. Zinc metal tarnishes in moist air and burns in air to form the white zinc oxide. It is a fair electrical conductor and will react with dilute acids to release hydrogen. Zinc does not react with water. There are numerous compounds of zinc, including zinc oxide and zinc chloride. Once the properties of an individual element have been identified, it is placed into a group of elements which have common properties and characteristics. Zinc is in the group called the transition metals. The 38 elements classified as transition metals are found in the middle of the periodic table in groups 3 through 12. Only a few of the transition metals are colored. Most of them are silver gray or silver bluish. As with all metals, the transition elements are ductile and malleable and good conductors of electricity and heat. They are generally hard and dense and less reactive than the alkali metals. Iron, copper, silver, and gold are important transition metals. Once the properties of an element have been established, we then have the ability to identify how it can be used. Zinc is used extensively in alloys. An alloy is basically a metallic material composed of a mixture of two or more substances. Examples are bronze, which is an alloy of copper and tin, brass, which is an alloy of two parts copper and one part zinc, gunmetal, which is an alloy of copper and zinc, and finally, ormolu, which is an alloy of copper, zinc, and tin that resembles gold. It is also used for flashing on roofs as a cheaper alternative to lead. One of the most important uses of zinc is in galvanizing or coating of other metals, because zinc resists corrosion. 
Zinc and its compounds is also used in the manufacture of batteries, paints, deodorants, wood preservatives, and in die castings by the automobile industry. The properties of zinc are classified by many other factors, including the melting point, boiling point, atomic mass, and density of the element. All of these precise measurements, together with additional facts and information, can be found on our website. So ends our simple guide to the element zinc. Check out our easy video guides to the other elements via our website.